Ladies and gentlemen, I've got some shocking and terrifying and upsetting news for all of you today. We have a new deep, dark, and evil entity emerging in the world of chess. You see, chess.com, uh, every month or so, will create some sort of new chess bots to keep our attention and fascinate us for some time. They do some holiday ones, they did some billionaire ones. Well, chess.com recently launched the cat bots. You are seeing that correctly. The lowest one is scaredy cat. Then it's angry cat. Then it's grumpers. And then it's cat sparrow. But the evil being is mittens. Mittens like chess. But how good is mittens? Now, you look at this idiotic bot with an elo of one and you go, oh, this is just another Martin. I mean, I'm just going to do whatever I want to the cat. I'll throw it around the room. Don't actually do that, please. But, uh, you know, metaphorically speaking, the same thing you would do to Martin. Um, folks, in this video, I'm going to play this bot and I'm going to show you what absolute pure insanity it is. I don't think there's a single human alive that is capable of taking down mittens. I will extend this a little bit further. Let me know if you want me to pair mittens against the most powerful form of stockfish. I will get a cloud server stockfish to play against mittens. It's going to be nuts. All right, this bot is level one. I don't think it is. Also, can I just say, who is chess.com hiring? Whose job is it to sit around and go, we need cat bots? What, like, what, what, what the heck, man? All right. Seriously, though, cool, cool idea. Um, I'm gonna play the first game as the, as the black pieces. I'm gonna give Mittens the black pieces. Uh, one more thing that Mittens does is it, is it talks. Meow, I like chess. He he he, I exist at the chessboard through all times and realities. He he he, who writes that nonsense, man? <coughs> anyway, I'm gonna play d5. Uh, I'm gonna play a queen's gambit. Ominously, I have played you a million times before in a million different universes. Like, what is this stoner cat that they got into this video? Um, I'm gonna play a Queen's Gambit declined. I feel like it's a pretty good opening to play against uh, a bot. Um, and I'm gonna play this A6 Queen's Gambit declined. Um, the idea being that you want to take on C4 and then play a very quick B5. Uh, and oftentimes the best move for white is in fact to clarify the center. All chess players eventually crumble under my mighty paws. I mean, meow. Terrific. <clears throat> um, now pawn takes d5. Uh, and, you know, the, the point of white taking on d5, which normally doesn't happen in Queen's Gambit positions, is the fact that you're basically arguing that the move a6 is a waste of time. Uh, which is, <clears throat> you know, to be determined. I develop my knight to f6. I have some ideas to play b5 and justify my move. Um, now I'm going to play this move c6 which strengthens my center, allows me to put my bishop on d6, and, oh, that's actually... Mittens, Mittens just took away the strategy that I wanted to play. Uh, it, I have a course upcoming, and I've been playing e3, bishop to f5, trying to, you know, utilize the active square. Mittens just took that away from me. <coughs> ah, terrific. Terrific, yes. Uh, okay, well, I guess I'm just gonna play bishop to d6. What? <gasps> oh no! Oh, if I take knight takes d5, pawn takes, and queen takes bishop. Oh my god, I fell for a trap. Oh, 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 oh god. Oh my god, it immediately punished me. It took advantage of my move order. Oh, I should have went here. Or here, or anything, literally any- Oh my goodness, I fell for a trap against the bot! Oh my, it's just gonna be a pawn up now. And the thing is, I don't have to lose the pawn. I could play pawn takes f6, but then my pawns are doubled and isolated and my king is open. Mittens, you don't scare me. I, I think I'm still gonna make a comeback. You know what? I'm, I'm not- What are you gonna do? Take the entire center? What do you think I'm worried about that? Oh. All right, let's develop the bishop to try to damage its pawn structure. What's it gonna do, just go here? 
Yeah, <laughs> life is easy when you're up a pawn, right? Especially when you're a 5,000 level computer. All right. Um, you know, just making developing moves while being a pawn down. At some point, it will go here. Okay, I don't want to trade my bishop just yet. Yeah. Now, the question is, where do I put my bishop? Because I think the knight is going to come here. I guess I'll just slide back to c7. Maybe I'll wrap around and attack the b6 pawn. I got to get revenge with white. I mean, this is ridiculous. What a silly mistake by me. Um, rook fd1 is interesting. Not playing rook ad1. I would have thought that this rook would have wanted to go there. But I'm also playing like a, you know, ridiculously powerful computer. So, all right, bishop d3. I don't want to take. I feel like I like the tension here. So maybe I'm going to play knight b6. To try to put my knight on d5. And at some point, it would be nice to play c5. Okay. Okay. Um, knight d5. I don't know what this does. Mm-hmm. H takes. Solid king position. Aha. It's attacking me here, and it also wants to take here so I don't get my queen active. And instead, I... Aha. Ah, yeah, right. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah. You see, a move ago, I played knight d5, and if Mittens had taken me, I would have activated my queen. My queen would have pointed at everything. But the way the computer is playing this, it wants me to defend my pawn, and then knight takes d5, it's just going to snap take my queen. But if I go back to b6, it's going to play a5 and justify the a-pawn advance. <laughs> and if I take here, it's going to take with a pawn and strengthen its center, and the pressure is still... <laughs> this is terrible. All right, let's go here. It's going to take with the pawn, of course. Now I'm going to play rook b8. I'm still a pawn down. This center is really strong. Let's see how the computer, like, puts me out of my misery here. Um, queen d7. I mean, I, I'm doing a decent job resisting. I like how the rook slid over. Probably the other rook is going to come, and here comes d5. Uh, yeah. Well, bishop a5 attacks the rook. Maybe the computer... Okay, computer won't see. Min's also stopped talking to me. I guess it ran out of voice lines. Whoever programmed it didn't really do a, you know, give it like three voice lines. Okay, it's just still marching down the center. I can't move my rook because of my pawn. I guess I'm going to take. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it, it's just I can't do anything. I mean, my bishop is obsolete. I have no threat on anything. I'm going to play b5 and try to break out with my rook. Okay. Uh, I'm going to play... Uh... B4, what is it going to play? Rook c5? Knight d4. Oh my god. Oh my god, now it has this. Why didn't it play that last move? Why didn't it play knight d4 last move? Oh god. See, I've been thinking that the knight can't move because I'm going to take the pawn, but if I take the pawn, there's knight... I'm dead. I'm like mega dead. Knight c6 is coming no matter what. Uh-huh. It's gonna take my rook. Actually, I think it... Oh! <laughs> it's not even taking my rook! It's using my bad queen's position as an opportunity to improve its position before it takes my rook. Or it's just going to take my bishop. It might even go here. Oh, God! Now it's gonna take my rook. Oh my god, it's refusing to take my rook in fact, it instead Mittens trapped my bishop! The computer evaluated that my rook is so bad, it doesn't even want to take it. Oh my god. Alright, now, 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 now look, I'm gonna go here. It's gonna play rook c8 check. I gotta, I'm, I'm dead. Oh my, oh my god. I'm attacking the rook! If I take and take and take, there's rook d8. What if I make a queen? It's just gonna... Meow, you promoted! Alright, thanks. Thanks, Mittens. Oh! <laughs> oh! 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 Oh my gosh. Oh, I gotta take and it's made. It let me queen. Dude, it let me make a second queen. Look at this. There was absolutely no need for this. And Mittens let me make a queen. 
It's gonna mate me! <laughs> the light that burns twice as bright burns half as long. You are not long for this game. What? Bro, this bot is so absurd. I would love to see the game review of this game. But it would, oh, I would need to open it in another tab. Oh my gosh. All right, rematch. I said I was going to play with, uh, with white. All right, I'm going to... We're going to win. I'm not scared of this stupid cat. All right, let's play my favorite opening. D4. And I'm going to play a Trumpowski. All right, it's thinking. That's a good sign. All right, we're going to play H4. The Raptor variation. All right, C5. D5. Aggressive stuff here. Oh, God. It's playing like the most sharp variation. There's like a line here. It's queen b2, knight e4. Is it going to take my free pawn? No human takes that pawn. Oh. Okay. I'm going to put my bishop on c3 to defend and take this diagonal. <clears throat> I actually have the computer right where I want it. Like, this is exactly the kind of position I like to get against human beings. I have more space. I have good control. I just have to monitor some of the counterplay that's possible, like with f5. Um, I'm going to play a4, try to instigate, take some queenside space. The computer is just totally unafraid. Maybe I'll play g4 too to stop f5. How wild are we feeling? Huh? Taking all this space against the, the bot, playing exactly like a bot would. All right? Maybe to be the, to, 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 you know, in the words of Max Holloway, you know, to beat the best, you gotta, be, to, to be the best, you gotta beat the best, and the best is blessed, or whatever, you know? So maybe all I gotta do is play like the bot, that's it, I just gotta, I just gotta take as much space away from the computer as possible. All right, I'm terrified, what is it doing? C4, what is this? What, it wants to bring its knight to C5? I don't understand. What a, what a move, that's it? All right, I'm just going to play F3. I'm nice and solid, my center is good. I'm kind of scared, but, you know, fear is healthy sometimes. Healthy amount of fear. Queen D2, I got a nice lock on the position. Computers really don't like when positions are locked. I'm going to maybe play H5 and try to, you know, just ask some questions over here with H... Okay, development, maybe move my king to safety or castle. I think so far, so good. Oh, that's hanging. I can't lose that. Oh my god. And if I go here, is it gonna go here and get my bishop? Ah. Uh. Oh, and if I go here, is it gonna take my pawn? No, it can't do that. Oh my god, it can do that. <clears throat> so now I have to either lose my bishop or lose a pawn. How did it... How did it do all this? This is... This is so abs I mean, come on. Come on, dude. I'm gonna castle. You can take my bishop, stupid cat. Bro, it's not even taking my bishop. It did all this. It's not even taking... It's refusing to take my bishop. Come on, bro. What is this? I gotta... I gotta... I gotta go, man. I gotta do something. You know what? I'm gonna stand up to the machine. F4! Let's go! I'm not scared of a robot. You can't beat me. You're nothing. I'm gonna play pawn takes, close the center, move my king, and start an attack. You don't scare me. Queen takes f4. Let's go. St oh, yeah, exactly. Now you have to play defense, stupid robot. Now I'm gonna play king g2 so I can enable this move in the future. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Oh, man. Is it just gonna go here? Do I just have nothing? Um, no. I'm gonna believe in myself. You know, believing in myself might not get me anywhere, but I'm still gonna believe in myself. I gotta get rid of my pawn weakness. Alright, it doesn't want me to get rid of my pawn weakness. I'm gonna go here. Advancement. 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 Bishop h4. I'm not scared. He got nothing. What are you going to do? Huh? Stoop. All right. It's basically saying I have no attack and I'm an idiot and it's going for my weak pawn. Uh, rook e3 to defend my weak. Wait, there's that pawn too. Ah. 
Oh, and I can't go here because then check. All right, well, what if I go to H1? Oh, it's threatening to trap my queen. Oh my god. All right, I gotta go here. That was nuts. Dude, leave me alone. Now it takes. It, it, look at this. It blocked my attack with its bishops. It's just blocking my attack. I got, how do I, how do I even put up resistance here? I have no more moves. I literally physically cannot move any pawn. I can only go here. Then it's going to take with check. All right, whatever. You know what? I'm doing it. I don't care. Take my knight. What? But, what? What? Oh, is there just a fork? Oh my god, no way. I did all that hyping myself up. I hyped myself up so hard, I can't even take. Oh, and it's just gonna defend. Oh no. Oh no, dude. All right, I'm still gonna look to sneak in. I'm gonna go here and try to play queen h5. Oh my god, it's not letting me. It's not gonna let me go queen h5 because now it sees my rook. Yo, what the... I am going to defend my rook, and then go here, and then queen h5. It... Nah, dude, this is... What, I'm going to win your pawn now. Good job. Yo, it trapped my rook. Oh, it trapped my rook. Oh, it trapped my rook in the center of the... It trapped my rook, dude. Nah, this is crazy. Nope. No, 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 no. No way. Oh my gosh, this is absurd. All right, take it. I'm almost scared. Bro, it's not taking my rook. What? The? Yo, it trapped my rook. It's, it's refusing to take my rook. This is unbelievable. This bot, for the second game in a row, Isolates one of my pieces and is refusing to take it because it, there are more pressing matters in the position. Look at my pieces. This thing is doing some ungodly things to. Oh my god, is it gonna take and push? Oh my god, is it gonna take and push? Yo, if I go here, it's forking my king and queen with its pawn. If I go here, it does this. All right, all right, fine. Well, if I go here, it's a fork. If I go here, it's, a, it's another fork. So I guess the only safe move is this. I didn't even see that! Oh! 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 Oh my god, it just... Yo, it just mated me! Nah, I didn't even see that! I was so preoccupied with this, this... And it, oh, no, 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 this is, no, 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 I don't know what y'all did, I told you in the beginning of this video that chess.com developed some evil being, that thing is satanic, it's a demon, now you let me know, because I need to go call up Stockfish, I'm gonna pair this thing against the strongest chess supercomputer in the entire world. This is some nonsense. Mittens with an elo of one? Is that fraud? Can I get the devs in trouble for fraud? All right, they are inflicting deep psychological scars on the users of ChessCon because you boot this up and you're like, I'm playing a level one bot. Ooh, I'm gonna beat it. And then it literally takes your soul. You could live 10 lifetimes. You wouldn't be half as good as Mittens. This is stupid. This is, I mean, I'm mad. I am mad. I don't know what chess.com just did. But this thing is evil, man. This thing is evil. And uh, I'm going to get revenge. Mark my words, this is not the last you've seen of Mittens in a YouTube video. Alright? Now get out of here.